welcome back everybody i am sanjay from let's learn video series today we go to look at some interview question and answer for active directory before we go any further i would ask you to like and subscribe my channel i would thank all these people who subscribe already my channel so let's learn this video what are the prerequisites to install active directory in your server Active Directory installation has certain requirements and prerequisites that you have to meet and fulfill before you have start installation of Active Directory on your first domain controller. NTFS partition, enough free space, administrative accounts, operating system, supported network card NIC, dedicated fixed IP address, DNA services and configuration, a domain name required, FQDN and NetBIOS. What is Active Directory? Why it used? Active Directory is a directory service created by Microsoft. It is included with most Windows Server operating system. Active Directory used to store directory objects like users and computers, printers. Using Active Directory bring a number of advantages to your network like uh, centralized user account management, centralized policy management, group policy management, better security management. What is FSMO role? There are 5 FSMO roles that are assigned to one or more domain controller that 5 FSMO roles are Schema Master The Schema Master domain controller control all updates and modifications to the schema. Once the schema update is complete, it is replicated from the Schema Master to all other DC in the directory. To update the schema of a forest, you must have access to the Schema Master. There can be only one schema master in the whole forest. Domain naming master. The domain na naming master domain control the additional or removal of domains in the forest. This DC is only one that can add or remove a domain from the directory. It can also help add or remove cross references to domains in external directory. There can be only one domain naming master in whole forest. Infrastructure master. When, a, when an object in one domain is referenced by another object in another domain, it re represents the reference by a GeoID. The SID for reference to security principle and the DN of the object bring reference. The infrastructure FSMO role hold is the DC responsible for updating an object's SID and distinguished name in cross domain object reference. At any one time, there can be only one domain controller acting as a, the infrastructure master in each domain. The infrastructure master role should be held by a domain controller that is not a global catalog server. If the infrastructure master run on a global catalog server, it will stop updating object information because it does not contain any reference to object that is does not hold. This is because a global catalog server holds a partial replica of every object in the as a result cross domain object reference in the in that domain will not be updated and warning to that effect will be logged on the DC event log. If all the domain controller in a domain also hosted host the global catalog, all the domain controller have the current data and it is, it is not important which domain controller hold the infrastructure master role. Relative ID, RID master. The RID master is responsible for processing RID pull request from all the domain controller in a particular domain. When a DC create a security principle object such as user or group, it attach a unique security ID SID to the object. This SID consists of a domain SID. The same for all SIDs created in a domain and a relative IDs RID that is unique for each security principle SID created in a domain. Each DC in a domain is allocated a pool of RIDs that is allow to assign to the security principle it creates when the dc allocated rid pool falls below a threshold that dc issue a request for additional rids to the domain's rid master the domain rid master res respond to the request by 
retrieving RIDs from the domain unallocated RID pool and assign them to the pool of the requesting DC at any time. There can be only one domain controller acting as a RID master in a domain. PDC Emulator The PDC Emulator of a domain is a authority for a domain. The PDC Emulator at the root of the forest beco become become authority for the enterprise and should be configured and gather the time from an external source. All PDC from role holder follow the hierarchy of a domain in the selection of their inbound time partner. In a Windows Server domain, the PDC emulator role holders retain the following functions. Password change performed by other DCs in the domain are replicated preferentially to the PDC emulator. Authentication failure that occur at a given DC in a domain because of an incorrect password are forwarded to the PDC emulator before a bad password failure message is uh, reported to the users. Third, account lockout is uh, processed on the PDC emulator. Fourth, editing or creating of a group policy object GPO is always done from the GPO copy found in the PDC emulators sysvol share unless configured not to be so by the administrator the PDC emulator perform all the all of the functionality that is Microsoft Windows NT 4.0 server based PDC or earlier PDC performed for Windows NT 4.0 based or earlier client what are the two forest specific FSMO role? Forest wide operation master role. The following role must appear at least one in, a, in, in every forest. Schema master and domain naming master. Tell me one easiest way to check all the five FSMO role. You can use netdom space query slash domain colon your domain space FSMO role command. It will list all the FSMO role handling domain controller. What are the physical component of Active Directory? The two physical component of Active Directory are domain controller and sites. What are the logical component of Active Directory? The logical part of Active Directory including forest, trees, domains, OUs and global catalog. What is the feature of domain local group? Domain local group are mainly used for granting access to the network resources. A domain local group can contain account from any domain, global group from any domain and universal group from any domain. For example, if you want to grant permission to a printer located at domain A to 10 users from domain B, then create a global group in domain B and add all 10 users into that global global group then create a domain local group at domain A and add global group of domain B to the to domain local group of domain A then add domain local group of domain A and then printer of a domain A security ASL how will you take active directory backup before you can backup AD server, you need to install the backup feature from the server manager. We need to go command line to backup Active Directory. Open up your command prompt by clicking start and type cmd and hit enter. In your command prompt, type webadmin start system state backup hyphen backup target colon e and then press enter. You can use different backup target of your choosing. Type y and press enter to start a backup process. Tell me few use of NTDS utility commands. NTDS utility is a Windows utility for configuring the heart of Active Directory. You can use the NTDS utility command to perform database maintenance of ADDS, manage and control single master operation and remove metadata left behind by domain controller that were removed from the network without being properly uninstalled. You can perform authoritative restore, configuration setting, partition management, set DSRM password and etc. 
what is a tombstone a tombstone is a object deleted from the directory but not yet removed from the database they are removed physically deleted by the garbage collection process once they are older than the tombstone lifestyle default tombstone lifetime windows server that use a tombstone lifeline of 60 days microsoft recommended to manual setting the value to 180 days one of the benefit this provide in increase in the useful life of back what do you understand by garbage collection explain in computer science garbage collection gc is a form of automatic memory management the garbage collector or a just collector attempt to reclaim garbage or memory occupied by object that are no longer in use by the program garbage collection was invented by jock macmo john mccree around 1959 to simplify manual memory management in lips programming language what is rodc an rodc is an additional domain controller for a domain that hosts a read only partition of an active directory database an rodc is designed primarily to be deployed in a branch office environment branch office typically have relatively few users poor physical security relatively poor network bandwidth to a hub site and little local it knowledge explain knowledge consistency checker kkc the kkc is a built in process that run on all domain controller it is a dynamic link library that modified data in the local directory in response to system wide changes which are made known to the kkc by change to the data within active directory the kkc generate and maintain the replication topology for replication within site and between sites by default the kkc review and make modification to the active directory replication topology every 15 minutes to ensure propagation of data either direct or transitive by creating and deleting connection by object needed what is syswall folder used for syswall is a simply a folder which reside on each and every domain controller within the domain it contain the domain's public file that need to be accessed by the client and keep synchronized between domain controller the default location for syswall is c windows syswall although it can be moved to another location during the promotion of a domain controller it's it's possible but not recommended to relocate the syswall folder dc promotion as there is potential